Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls for Alpha 20 series. It's the morning of day 11. The trader restocks today. We just finished our fourth hoard. Man, I really hope we got more than just today to prep Keep this new uh, base. So we're going to move to the Shamway building today. Get away from the trader a little bit, I think. And try and force ourselves to be a bit more self-sufficient. Uh, and come back to the trader when we need to sell stuff. I think we're probably just going to get straight into looting things. Um, as opposed to um, constantly be taking missions from this guy. Now we will eventually just start coming back and taking more missions, but I want to get ourselves solidified. You've got Molotovs, which are nice. Actually, let's Time have a quick look off. here. We did finish Scavenger off. Now, we gained a few skill points yesterday. We've got four available, and we are level 27 now. So we are past the 25 milestone. We can make a big forge. We can make a mixer, but we're going to do that when we get over to the new place. Uh, we're still running with garbage armor, so hopefully we can find something better than what we have. But I, I mean, I don't really care. I'm, I'm fine with this uh, as we currently have it. Now, uh, let's have a look back at this guy. Um, oh, we wanted to spend the skill points first. Sorry. Uh, so let's have a look here. I'm thinking that we're going to go, because we want to maximize efficiency, I think, when while we're at the trader. And being able to buy and sell stuff is going to be super important. So his secret stash is, stash is going to show better loot now, which is nice. Hopefully we get more ammo and stuff as well coming up. We want to put this to level 3, so let's do that. Because um, now we can make tier 2 mods, which will really help us out. Okay, so, um, can I see your inventoire? I'm going to buy these right off the bat. Because that's pretty much our next Horde Knight right there. Uh, we want to look for shotgun ammo. Got a full mixer. I'm not gonna, I mean, we can make all that stuff. It's only the stuff that's gonna be resource intensive, like resource difficult. I don't wanna say intensive, but difficult at this stage. We wanna buy like ammunition. So there's a friggin' full crucible. We can't make steel until we get uh, steel tools. And I think it's like level 40 or something we have to be at to be able to make steel. So it's not like we can actually do that even if we just get a crucible. There's the steel tool schematic. Ooh, that gives us the ability to make steel, does it not? Thank we have God to be. You're done browsing. Next time I'll charge you for that. Um, there is a lock to this, right? Tool crafting three, player level thirty. So we're not that far out from making steel. We have everything else: science, weapon, and tool. We don't have labor class. Ooh. Um. Is there anything else in the secret stash? Not really. So this is a good option. You've got shotgun rounds. But I think we wait. We buy the steel tools recipe, which allows us to make steel. We don't have a crucible yet, but even if we bought the crucible, we wouldn't be able to make steel anyway. Um, from what I understand. So... And I, since I'm not finding any libraries anywhere, or uh, bookstores that is, I think we go ahead and buy the Steel Tools recipe now. Where are you? At the bottom, right? Right, we'll get the Steel Tools schematic. And we need to find three books today, so let's buy as much shotgun ammo as we can get from you. Um, definitely can't buy it all, maybe like 80? Pretty close. 73? Actually, let's buy 52. That way we'll have a full stack and still some money left over. Wait, what did I just do? 52. Oh, I was looking at this for how much we have left. Coin, 28, but we, we've got... Okay, never mind. I'm an idiot. Okay, so we got a full stack and we got a bit more. So I think we're okay for the next horde. If it comes quickly, we'll be fine. Now, we got to determine... The math. I did the math. You do the math. All right, we got to determine what we're taking with us. So I'm going to pick up all our workstations. Okay, that's the workstations. I'm just going to grab these out of here. Okay, we'll go ahead and use that. Don't scrap it. Use it. Alright, these we want to take with us. Okay, guns and ammo. Let's take... We need those for a forge. Um, we want to take our ammo. And that weapon. I should have merged these before, but... That's fine. We'll leave the rifle here. We, we got to come back anyway, so... What do we need immediately? Stuff for making food with, for sure. I don't... I think we're going to build a rooftop... Well, I don't know. Rooftop garden's probably a mistake, because if we do that, then... 
birds and stuff will just completely obliterate it. Man, we're going to need to get, uh, oh, we're going to need to get some meat today. Got a little bit here. Take that, that. Might as well use this now, get it out of our inventory. Let's take you. Uh, we'll take those, take that. We gotta come back, so let's not go crazy here. Somebody blew up a car outside. The bones can probably stay here for now. Do we have, here's a good question. Do we have the ability, to, I think we have the ability to make first aid bandages. I kept these guys. So we should be able to do, yeah. Get those crafting. Those can go back in there. Let's take the shooting turret and the ammo. Take a splint. We're going to take that stuff. Let's take the two maps because we'll probably open them while we're over there. We're going to definitely need an engine. Take the junk sledge so we can position it. The hammer for upgrades. The writing desk and our pages. Um, let's take both engines. Okay, uh, nothing in there. Now, that's kind of good, though. So, um, repair kits we'll take. Uh, oil, springs, you, you, you. Nails for making boxes. Cobble, definitely. Those guys, yes. Ooh, we don't need that. We'll take the generator and the switches and the lights, because I might actually run some power. We'll take you with me. You, you, you. A couple of batteries, the leather, the plastic, that so I don't have to get any, the duct tape, paper we're going to need, the sand for when we get a mixer up. I'm only going to take part of the concrete. We'll take that so we can make ammo. Um, the land claim block for sure. I think... That's probably good for now. Ooh, we want to take these guys and the animal fat. And you. Got all our water. Um, okay, I think we're good. Let's go put a bunch of this stuff in the bike. I'm going to grab a, a quest from Hugh. I don't want to take too, too much. Well, well, another survivor. Yeah. I hope you got money. Oh, I got money, Bubba. So, where are... We're, we're more to the west or southwest. I don't want to see your inventory. I, I want to see your jobs. Anything to the southwest? No. Fetch clear to the south. Where do you? No. Are you out of your mind? I am. Do you have one in a bookstore? Victorian so, house. You're not interested. We'll not that one. I'm not. No. Again. I got a job for you. Cemetery. Sure. I, hope you have a game plan. I never have a game plan. You should know that by now, Hugh. Oh, I guess it was a wandering horde. Um, question is, how much ammo do I want to burn on these guys? Oh, look at you swimming in my friggin' crop water. Uh, I guess we gotta... I guess we gotta spend a bit of ammo on these guys. I heard the banging and I'm like, I thought it was just a couple of guys. Wow, look at that. Okay, you're gone. Oh, hey, you. I have no idea where your head is, but we got you. Stop wobbling. Back line has become the front line now. Oh, oh, wait for it. Wait for it. There we go. A couple of bags. Hopefully there's something good in there. Okay, drop a bunch of stuff in the bike. Uh, storage. Drop you all in there. Oh, hey, it's a runner. How's it hanging? A little to the left, I see. Mechanical parts. Oh, another ratchet. Okay. Alright, let's get to the Shamway building. Uh, so priority today, if we see any animal, we're going to kill it, because we need meat badly. And then, uh, we're going to clear the Shamway building. 
which shouldn't take too long. That place is kind of like a remnant, so there's not a lot there. Clear the Shamway building. And then once the Shamway building is cleared, um, we'll start to fortify it so it's protected at nighttime, so we don't have to worry about being attacked well, during the day or night, so the zombies can't get to me. And then we'll worry about how we're going to be holding down the horde from that point forward. I think what we'll probably end up doing is I'm going to build a, to start, a step base. And then we'll figure out where the pit base is going to be. Uh, once we get better tools, we can dig the pit base. Because um, it's going to require a lot of work. Like normally it would be like a couple of ep episodes of me just prepping the, like the pit base. But uh, we may not have that amount of time between hordes. So... I'll do my best to get what I can done, done. And then uh, we'll determine where we're going from there. Okay, we got a wolf back here. Is that a dire wolf or a regular wolf? I think it's a regular wolf. Uh, might not be. Nope, it is. Should be able to kill it with the bow. Oh yeah. I just don't think we hit it with, in the head with the first shot. Okay, hopefully this gives us like more than 10. 12 meat, not bad. Chicken! That was an easy kill. Ah, that wasn't an easy kill, my god. Another six meat, that puts us at 19. And another level, nice, 28. We got the spillway right next to us for a water source, because yum. That should be good. <laughs> good for water. And body parts and alligators and whatever else is in there. Alright, let's clear out the outside first. We're going to have Zambonis here everywhere for the first little bit, and that's fine. Every morning we're probably going to have to come out and like clear out zombies. Although, if they're going to keep dropping loot for me, I'll, I'll be happy with that. What do we got in here? Uh, got to go in this way? Anybody here? Nobody here, but we got a Shamway box. Any good food? Ah, eh, whatever. Grab the cobble, because we're going to need it. The paper we can grab a different time. Nothing there. A little bit of wood. We have to figure out where we're going to plant some trees, too. I don't want to constantly be leaving here to go elsewhere to get trees. I mean, I guess we could plant them right there. Right, we're kind of in a good spot. Right? We're, like, right on the edge of the industrial area. So we've got all these houses that we can loot. And then when we're higher level, we can just push into the town. And get better loot in the town. Okay, we can sell that. All right, we got some more cobble here, which we'll grab. Okay, now before we clear the rest of this place, let's go around the front, since it's relatively quiet. Let's check the trash here. Okay, there's a ladder up here, which means we need to knock this out. Because they can definitely figure out how to get up there, I would imagine eventually. Now we can just probably quickly put in, for our access, uh, another piece of ladder. Like that. That we can pull up at any time. Alright, so we got a ledge here. This has got potential. We got a ledge here. Although this half block is kind of annoying as shit. I mean, we could make the ramp base here. Nah, I don't know. I think maybe we got to do it in the parking lot. Problem is, is that these are all like, like uh, quarter blocks or whatever they are, or plates, so that I can't put anything down on top of them because it counts as a full block. So that's kind of annoying. Uh, let's get... What's the best? I mean, we can just break this right now. I mean, we gotta replace all these blocks anyway, so let's just get in here. Grab the plastic. Did we check the trash? We did. Okay, so I'm thinking that we're gonna use 
probably the third floor. So that's wood. That's just a bathroom. We'll have to block all that up. Actually, that goes out onto the roof. So, I mean, we could put a... Yeah, we can put a, um, a doorway out there. Probably be getting rid of all these windows. Okay, let's get some... Do I have my nails on me, or did I leave them in the bike? They're in the freaking bike, because, of course, where else would they be? Uh, let's put some stuff in here. And we'll go down and grab the stuff, the nails from the bike. Now, this door is locked. But I think this leads up to the roof. Yeah, there's the stairwell. Actually, let's just go down this way. It's probably faster. Oh, hey! I'm just gonna... Oh, I can't get over you. Can't get over you. It's a little too big. Wouldn't matter what zombie was there. They're all too big. Where are you? Inside? You're inside. Alright. Break this door open. I mean, the benefit of using this place... Didn't want to have to do this right now. The benefit of using this place is that eventually we can fill this in with concrete, right? And then it's like... If they somehow break in here, the building is not going to collapse, right? Like, eventually it'll just get all filled in. Because I'm expecting really horrific hordes. Alright, I wasn't wanting, didn't want to do this right now, but... See if we can wake anybody else up here. Anybody? Nobody? Well, usually there's somebody down here. Not today. Actually, is there anything in there? There's a backpack. Alright, not a lot. Get out of that. That's the door we came in. And grab the cobblestone and stuff from here. Okay, four piles of cobblestone, not too bad. So that goes out to the front. This is the... Alright. Might be able to use this as like a little... I don't know how that would work. It's kind of like a little trap, right? I don't know if that... would work. Uh, that... Uh, okay. Well, there's that. Well, I'll get some iron resources out of that. But I don't mean, like, using this right now. I mean, like, as a kind of a part to a base. You know? Like, I mean, our pit trap base, like, the pit's gonna be a little bigger than this. It'll probably be like a 4x4. Four four. Just so that the zombies can spread out their damage over a bigger area of wall when they're in it. And then we just drop grenades in there and it's over for them. Um, yeah, okay, well, I guess the building's clear. Except for whatever's up on the roof. So let's get the stuff, some stuffs from the bike. I think we can grab all of it, if I'm not mistaken. Should be able to grab all of it. Yep, and let's take that up. As long as we can actually... Jump to the ladder, which I think we should be able to. Gonna leave the doors open so the do zombies don't break them. I don't know if they will... I don't know if they're gonna see that as a way to get me to me, though. I guess I'm gonna have to test that out. Alright, let's get some storage boxes down. Uh, where are they here? Now, I don't use the writable boxes, because eventually I'm going to be uh, painting these. Let's get four of them going. We're going to definitely need them. Alright, then we got to start knocking out all of the rubble and all of the lousy um, block pieces. And we got to figure out how we're going to lay out our horde base. And where. I think we I think we do have to do it out kind of more towards the parking lot. Um, I don't think we're really going to get, you know, half-decent... Um, traction back here. Let's drop all these guys in there. Let's bring the workbench down. Let's put you here. And I can't because of course this board. Put 
it like that. Actually, let's take the stuff out of here. Go ahead and break this down. Yeah, so I think around back is probably going to be the best. Now, most of the stuff we can just leave in the boxes. I'll get the rest sorted tonight. Drop all that. I'm going to need that. I'm going to need that. Uh, these two go in the workbench. I'm going to keep some Molotovs on me. I don't need that ammo on me. Style this back one. Uh, what else? Anything else we need out of here? Oh, we need to put a cooking pot down. Let's put that down. I'm probably going to eat this and get rid of it. We'll take one of these with us. Um, let's eat one of these now for digestive efficiency. Then we'll eat these guys. Okay. We need to get springs today. Oh, we need to... Oh, yeah. Let's get a... Um, oh, we need to make a metal workbench. I can't make a... Uh, right. Shit. Do we have enough electrical parts? We do. We got you. I think that's all we need. Okay, let's get... Uh, first of all, campfire crafting. We got a land claim block. Where is it? I put that right in the center of our building. Now, we got to put you and you in there. And then if we go... W-O-R, metal workstation. Get that crafting. Three minutes. Okay, cool. Uh, let's put you... Actually, let's put the boxes... I gotta take that out of there. Put the boxes here. Then let's put our campfire just there for now. And we'll drop you and you in there. And let's put you... Like that for now. You are going downstairs, and then this stuff can go away uh, here for now. I gotta sort that. We'll sort this later. I'm not worried about it. Uh, cobble can come down. Uh, yeah, any ammo we make has to be made in the metal workstation. So let's get going on the building. All right, down below. Let's put you... Oh, man, these are half blocks. Oh, okay. Um, I want to put you in the middle, though. So let's put you... I mean, it's not the middle, but... It's pretty close. That should encompass the entire building. I know we still haven't checked out the attic and stuff yet, but that's fine. Um, anything in here? Oh, well, that's really nice. I think I checked that. Eh. We left all our brass back at home. Or at Hughes. I think this place is, should be empty. Yeah, okay. I'm going to grab the resources from here. Then we're going to head out back. Alright, not a lot of resources there, but that is what it is. Okay. So the zombies got to come around and go in the back. I don't really care to break these. Okay, they got to come in through here. So, if we're going to build it... Since that corner is kind of knocked out already, that, I think, is where we're going to make our... It's a little high up, though. But we could build it here. Like, right in here. Because this is all empty all the way up, I can di dictate where I want my second level to be. So let's go and do that. Let's take this tire out of here. Now you're guaranteed a tire now, which is kind of weird. Uh, all my frames are upstairs. Damn it! So I just realized something on my way back up here. I gotta take out the stairway. To the first floor. Because if I don't, then what's gonna happen... Um, if the zombies spawn on this side of the building is that they're going to see that this is a way to get up to my level. They're going to come along here, break their way through there, and then out through here, and then try to get to where I am over here. Probably. Don't know 100% sure, but I'm probably sure that that's what they're going to try and do. Which I don't want them to do. I want them to run around, or at least go the path I've decided for them. Okay, that's that. Backpack. 
One electrical part, I'll take it. And there's probably one underneath here too, so let's just break this open. I wonder if we can break it faster with this. Oh, we can. Nothing in there. Okay. So this is where we want our base to be. So we're going to fill all of this in, which is really shitty because these blocks here are like ramp blocks. Uh, I don't I don't want to spend the time breaking them out though. That's the problem. That's the problem. I don't want to spend all my time breaking these freaking blocks out. So we're just going to have to fill in. Like all this gets filled in. This is uh, this is risky. I'm kind of trying I'm relying on having a good idea what I think the zombies are going to do. I gotta make sure they have a way out to me. Which means... At least one of these has gotta be broken. Right? So that they've got a way to get out to me. At least make that weaker so that they can hit that one. Okay, we're gonna leave it soft and we'll leave it like that. Now, um... Let's bring these guys... Actually, we'll use the frames first. So that's a full... Ah, oh, man, they got... The ledges are there, too, like... So that's... Uh, yeah. I mean... That side's not going to be any better. Okay. And the sun's going down. Well, it is a day after Horde, so I mean... If we fill that in... Am I biting off more than I can chew here? Do we want to go ahead and, like, build a Horde base elsewhere? But this would work so well. It's got so much space. It just needs so much. There's so many of these little blocks that need to be removed, you know? Like, we got to pull these out. And it's like concrete. Ah. Well, there's always John Hams for a horde base. But like I said, we've already kind of done that. So, like... Shot chemicals. All right, let's go over here. I got to think about this. I don't I don't know. I'm kind of up in the air about this. I like the idea of building the Shamway base, but the fact that we're the fact that we're on the horde um uh, random free uh, every 2 to 4 days. Whoa, hey. Come on, you don't come running up on me like that. It's not very nice. Come on, wake the fuck up. Come on, you guys. That was somebody else outside. Military guy. Anybody a runner? No? I gotta watch out for that now. <laughs> I love that fall. It's just like the... Oh, shit. Go away. Killing blow. You've been beating on this for a while, huh? Downtown. Downtown. Let's grab the concrete. Or cement, sorry. They're over stuck on something else. Grab you. So there's this place too. Like this place. We got the wall around the outside. This is a relatively small footprint place. Which we could fill in. Eventually. They're making their way. Surprised we haven't seen a wandering horde yet. 
Unless that's the Wandering Horde. Alright, now I think there's still a couple guys sleeping in here. Yep. Come on, bring you out and then I'll murder the other guys while they, while they sleep. Did I hear somebody else? No? Oh, I did hear somebody else. And he's a runner. Damn it! It hits the man, it gets the stick. Come on, you guys, break through. You can do better than that. Anybody else left in here? Nobody? Alright, let's grab the loots. Not a lot. Mostly garbage. Mostly garbage. Mostly garbage. Well, the first aid kit will probably come in handy at some point. More power. Come on. We got two more. Alright. We just need one more now. Actually, let's go looking for it. We got crickets, but we're okay. We yeah, alright. Uh, is there bookshelves in this house? There is, and I know where it is, too. Look at you guys back here making noise. Yeah, you hit her. Tell her to move faster. She's slowing the whole train down, isn't she? There you go. I helped you out. She's out of your way now. You can't do anything with it, but she's out of your way. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Kill you. Solar panels. Lots of stuff to harvest around here, I'll give you that. Right, grab this. Some feathers. It'd be kind of cool if we could have a base where we could use a bow for a part of the Horde Knight. Problem with using... There it is. And there we go. Don't need anything else out of here, but we will see what medical supplies you've got. Ooh, a little bit of glue. Take that. Oh, that's all. That's nice. Grain alcohol. We can make a Molotov out of that. Grab the empty jar. Let's just... Uh, we got the time. Hey, Mr. Skater Boy. I got an arrow for you. Ooh, ooh. Okay, let's scrap this. We can scrap these. Two. Can we speed run this? I think so. Because fuck this house. Get over here. Really hoping to get that guy midair, but can't have everything. Alright, let's see what's in there. We, we need this for clay because we have like very little. Oi! <laughs> bet you stay bet you wish you stayed in there. Alright, we'll grab this. And you know this house, I keep forgetting. And I know it's there, but I keep forgetting that there's a weapon bag right here. I do that so often. I just like run through this house and then just completely forget that. Grab that. I'm going to search this kitchen real quick. We're running low on food, but we got enough meat now. I can make some more steak and potatoes. Actually, I think I can make meat stew tonight. So we'll get that going again. That's like really great. Grab this. Ooh. I don't know what recipe that was, but we'll have a look in a second. Grab that. Grab that. We need the we need the jars, so that's good. Grab this. Just take that. Leave the sham witch behind. We can scrap you. Scrap you. Scrap you. Go ahead and use you. And what are you? Vegetable soup schematic. I'm gonna use that. I don't want to go too far in my farmer. If I don't have to. Scrap you. Alright, we gotta hurry. Hello? Nobody? Should have one guy in the next room here. Uh, yeah. 
I think we can leave that behind safely enough. Wake up. Thank you. Thank you for being here. All right, that we can scrap because we're already the farmer and we know all that stuff. Oh, yeah, baby. Now we can make the chem station. Let's break this apart. Uh, we need the springs. Where's my wrench? Right there. Panicking. Take those. 48 gunpowder. That's not bad. At least you're unlocked. Nothing in there. Come on, fuckers. You thought you could crawl and get past me. Look at you. Trying to be a champion. Champion of dying, maybe. Alright, I got that. Uh, wooden crate. Okay, AK. Might be able to put that into use next uh, Horde Knight. I find right now that the AK is really useful only if you're um, you're in a spray and pray kind of base, like situation where you can just point and spray into a massive amounts of zombies. Whereas if I can't do that, I think I would just rather use a shotgun and just single target heads. That's not bad. All right, well, we got some stuff for the trader. So let's get the hell out of this place and get back home. All right, so just to be careful, I just kind of decided to walk that, uh... Oh, I can't put anything in there. I can put it right here, though. I decided to walk to see if I could get to the uh, ladder without falling off, and I can. So what that means the zombies can do it, too. So if they know I'm up here, they can probably get up here to get to me. So I'm going to put that there just to be safe. And I'm going to dump all this stuff in here. So what I'm going to do tonight, uh, this way, is get these boxes sorted... We've got our pages now, so let's actually do that, because we've got our... Did I bring the ink? Did I didn't bring the ink, did I? Oh. I did not bring the ink. I was staring right at it, too, and thinking, ah, I'm not going to need this. I did not bring the ink. God damn it. Oh, we got stuff to, the sell to, to sell to the trader tomorrow anyway. Oh, man. That's a big, big mistake. Okay, well, fair enough. I'm going to get these boxes sorted tonight. We'll get the metal workstation down. Actually, I'm going to pull... Can I fit anything in here? Or is there a door frame there? No, I can. So let's pick you up. We'll put the metal workbench beside this regular workbench. Um, so they're side by each. What we'll do is we'll get the cement mixer tonight made get as much concrete as we can moving which won't be very much but we'll get some of it moving tonight um so at least we've got a mixer done come on like that and like that drop you in there so we'll get all that done tonight uh grab you and you and i'm gonna need forged iron I got springs, I need mechanical parts, which are in my other box. Engine, there's the springs, mechanical parts, oh, more forged iron, not you, you, right? Now I think we need more acid for a chem station, what am I missing here? Oh, let's <sighs> get you crafting, all right, so. For the chem station, we need acid. I think we've only got like three. Cooking pots, no problem. I can make those. I'm going to make a uh, big forge tonight as well. If I've got the clay. I don't think I have the clay, but I, if I do, I'll make it. Bottle of acid. We can get all this stuff, no problem. Forge iron, we can get, no problem. The beaker. Did we have a beaker? I think we... Did I leave it back at the other uh, place? I thought we had a beaker. I didn't bring it, though. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's back at the other place. Oh, so many things to do. And we didn't even get started on a horde base tonight. Oh, my God. Okay, well, I'm going to leave this episode here. I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do tonight. Hopefully, we don't have a horde tomorrow. 
And, I, and it's nice that I actually have that set so that it shows up in the morning so I know if I'm going to die or not. I thought I left it on the evening, but I guess I didn't. Anyway, we'll get that done. I'll get some food made tonight, and tomorrow we'll probably head over to the trader, grab a bunch of stuff that we need, come back, figure out what we're doing for the Horde base, probably loot a place. We'll do the job for him on the way to him tomorrow. We'll do that. Go to him. Um, get our reward, pick up our stuff, come back here, and then figure out what we're doing for the next Horde night. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to leave this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please forget to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.